Hi everyone, this is Vince here from Build Intellect. I'm with here with I'm here with uh, Ragib. So we're looking today at how Ragib managed to improve his CV and land a job. Um, yeah. So can you tell me a bit Hi, more? Hi, Ragib. This is Ragib, and thank you for improving my CV to a beta level to getting his job. Of course. So it's. Uh, very helpful for me to getting a job. Actually, I was fresher from, I was passed out from 2019 and was looking for jobs desperately from one year. So you made my resume in such a format that I got a job in some days. It doesn't nice. look so much days to get a job because it was already shorted everything and, and everyone puts his focus on that and got my job. Nice. You highlighted my my skills and what what was hidden on that. No one will getting that skills to get me hired, but you made me you made my resume so highlighted that my skills are proper looking so that anyone can hire me by that one things. Cool, That's what's cool. Yeah, very ha happy to hear that. So so uh, what, what sort of job did you get? A data analyst job, is that right? Uh, actually, I, I was working as a data analyst as well as Power BI developer in a company. Okay. Okay. So and, your... uh, Yes, please. Sorry. Uh, was that your old job or your new job? Yeah, it's my new job. Your new job? It's my new job. Excellent. Yeah, and... Um... Yeah, so, so you said you were looking for, for a job for quite a while before, and then... Yeah, I was looking for it around one year before, and after that, I met with you in LinkedIn, and you made my resume in so cool stuff that I could get a job in a proper way. Brilliant. That, that, that's very thankful for me. Yeah, no worries, man. Okay. So, yeah, how, how's the job? Uh, are you enjoying it? Yeah, I'm enjoying it. I'm, I'm getting my job in my, in my skills. So it's very helpful for me that I got my job in my skill only to build my skill to be in a, uh, I was in an intermediate to uh, just up at the intermediate level. And right now I'm looking, I'm pursuing my level to be as a professional level. Excellent. Oh man. Very nice. So, yeah. Uh, so, like, what, did, what made you decide to to go with us to get your to improve your CV, your resume? Uh, I couldn't get you. Can you repeat the question? What you asked? Okay. Sure. Yeah. So, uh, so we found each other on LinkedIn, right? Or was it was it LinkedIn? Right. Facebook. I can't remember. And um, so, for example, like, uh, what made you interested in uh, in our services, helping with your CV, your resume? Uh, in my resume, one thing what we actually do, we made our skills in behind the below somewhere else. We put like hobbies, all the stuff, okay. just to upper level. But what this man does for me. He just sorted all the things which is needed for an interview, which will be highlighted that someone will look on it and just catch it on. This question is this. The interviewer may, may not be go to the second page or third page to look on it. He will just look on the first page and the skills and pick up you and make interview with you. Uh, this guy made me uh, realize and make my resume so that I get, I understand that this is my fault where I was putting myself below there. Okay. So, so you caught the attention of uh, different employers, right? Right. Very quickly, you say. Nice. Yeah, excellent. And uh, yeah, so, so you said it was just a few days, was it? How long did it take to find a, a job after? Like, do you start getting interviews uh, after uh, the CV change? After the CV, I think not more than one month. Okay. So yeah, much quicker. Excellent. 
So great. Uh, really, really happy to hear about that. So let me think. Uh, yeah. Would you would you recommend us to other people? Yeah. Why not? Because uh, we don't know how to make the resume properly. When basically when we are fresher or just uh, new graduate, you can say that new graduate, we don't have ideas to make the resume how it it to be, or how an interviewer or HR person needs the resume to be built in. Our resume is the first impression to solve that how the person is. So and uh, you guys are making the as well as the impression of the person to be better as well as his resume to be good. In my experience, you helped me a lot as well as for my impression as well as for my resume because if the resume is a cool stuff now, you will get better job. Excellent. Yeah. And yeah, hopefully there'll be a good stepping stone to the next job as well or staying in the same organization and, and developing your career so yeah hopefully uh, right, it... now, uh, so right now right now i was here only i was developing myself to be better in my career after that after maybe a year or two i will look forward for another job okay sure when i will be a professional okay so uh do you think that we would be useful for some people you know no. Yeah. Can we help someone? Yeah, th 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 that's the thing I was saying that because uh, don't know, maybe from 100 to 10 percent that they can make the resume better. But no. remaining people are still looking for a job as a new graduate. There's quite difficult to get a job. But you persons make the resume as such that a person will get a job according to the skills, not by the experience. Okay. Yeah. So I will recommend that people may come to you and get their resume built to be proper way and they will get the job as their recognition they need. Great. Cool. Very happy to hear that. So yeah, why should somebody like a, a data scientist, data analyst, data professional uh, take action and seek our help? Great. Should they do that? I, I couldn't get to you. Oh, sorry. So uh, why if uh, if somebody is looking for a good job and uh, why should they take action to seek our help? Okay. 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 That, that, that's good. That's good. Uh, basically, I was also a data scientist and uh, I have cool stuff in machine learning as well as in AI, but I was still not getting job because mm -hmm. what happens now? I couldn't mention my things in proper way. Uh, in some resume, I just put that I know machine learning AI. In some resume, I just put elaborate all the machine learning stuff that I have learned. And I just uh, measured all my skills over there. And uh, when the interviewer asked me the questions, I was a little confused that actually what was that? Where did he got the link that he was asking like this question? So these are the mistakes we really do. Okay. As a new graduate, what we thought that we know these things, we can properly give the things. But uh, no, I don't think so that we need to update all the things in the resume. We no, Yeah, we know the things. We know the things, but in the cases, we have to mention some amount of skills. Like if I know machine learning, I have to mention like, uh, for example, logistic regression, linear regression, that are the cool stuff to give in answers. If you are going to be put like a, a time series data analysis you have done, it's some difficult things to be answering. Sure. So, so you got to put in your so, CV what you know that, about, right? Right. Okay. With uh, what I was saying that when someone is a data scientist or looking for data analyst or some beta job, so it doesn't matter that his skills are good, but his resume is also to be good. Right. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, sure. It's not good enough to, to have the technical skills. You also have to uh, get people to Proper understand that, that you are good. Yeah, it's like uh, soft skills, right? Right. Resume. Yeah. Okay. So that's good. That's good advice. Um, so how can somebody find out more about you? Uh, maybe online? Uh, maybe via from LinkedIn or Facebook profile. Okay. So, so what's your, what's your full name on uh, LinkedIn, for example? It's S K Raghib Rahi. S K Raghib Rahi. Awesome. Cool. Uh, thanks very much for that. Uh, good, goodbye everyone. And hope that was a useful in interview for you. I certainly okay. enjoyed it. Thanks. Thanks SK. Thank you. Thank you Vince. Sorry. Have a nice to meet with you and Bye. Yeah. See ya.